Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Mary, and today we are interviewing the famous Italian scientist Enrico Fermi. Let him come in. Welcome, Mr. Fermi. Good afternoon. Thank you so much, everyone. You've made the revolutionary discoveries in the nuclear fields up to now. How did you come up with uh, such innovative theories? Honestly, I'm a genius. Maramortes never would have thought of those ideas. <laughs> Why don't you tell us about your first discovery about the atom? Uh, I did everything on my own. But I thought you were part of a group named I Ragazzi di Via Panisperna. How do you know that? Please continue your story. Well, at the beginning everyone thought the best way to pierce the nucleus of an atom of uranium-235 was bombarding it with alpha particles. But I noticed that there was a repulsion due to the same positive charge of the alpha particles and the protons in the nucleus. So, what did you do? Obviously, I immediately had a brainstorm. I decided to replace the alpha particles with neutrons because they haven't got a charge. Interesting, and what happened on the morning of the 16th of July 1945? Well, it's a confidential information, but since it's you, I can talk about it. Um, yes, there are only... 10,000 people listening to us, but, but go ahead, go ahead. I created the first nuclear device and I made it explode in a desert in New Mexico. There were no victims, I did it just for the science. So, did you contribute positively to the science? At the beginning, nuclear physics was used negatively, but now, in the 21st century, it's used in medicine and to create electricity. A question from the audience. Let's hear it. How is nuclear power used in medicine? It's used in order to diagnose and cure cancers. And what about electricity? Electricity created by nuclear energy is clean since it has a low emission of carbon dioxide. In the future, maybe, it will replace the polluting fossil fuels. What do you envisage for the future of nuclear energy? The only possibility of new great discoveries in physics resides in the eventuality you succeed in studying in detail the inner core of the atom. Audience, this will be your task. Thank you so much, see you next time. You have heard the history of nuclear power didn't start in the best possible way, but today these researches led us to huge benefits in the fields of medicine and electricity. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.